tell me the sad thing. Sad thing is because if you tell me the bar, we at the bar. Okay, we at the bar even worse because I don't care. At the bar, I will just walk away. I don't even bother. Yeah, depends if it's a business meeting. No, but you didn't walk away that day with a strange man. You were very kind to try to teach him some lessons because I was with you. I was there with my girlfriend. No, you should have just told me. I would have walked away. Oh, okay. If I'm alone, I don't care. But because I was with my girlfriend and I don't want to lose the night that I promised to have fun with my girlfriend, we can go so I have more patience and calm down. No, we can someone. just go a few shops now. Oh, okay. Then next time now, <laughs> I know. If got <laughs> idiot guy, come and just bait. Let's go. Yeah, because for me, right, I, I after a while, what happened between that? Not, not what happened because we were at the same table, lah. Huh? Mm -hmm. But their conversation, I was not listening because I checked out already. I'm yeah. Like this is the, this conversation is like. Going nowhere because it's just like a thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Because for me, it's like if I already, I don't even there. I already walked a long time ago. Yeah. So, me too. so for me, it's like I because I bring my girlfriend out, and I don't want my girlfriend to have a not. And we have a drink on the table too a while. So I'm like, is it not nice that I ask my girlfriend? No, out you just, just because tell of me this. Yeah. We are going to go to some other bar, and then we will finish our drink. I said, okay. Oh, now I know. Like, I'm like, then that. when when then when we say bye, the guy say we are leaving. Yeah, we are leaving because of. Yeah, yeah, I would just I wouldn't even say you. I just because of yeah. Right. So <laughs> it's, if if it depends on the setting. If you tell me the setting, then I know how I deal with it. But if you tell me only me and her, I don't I don't. Okay, know maybe it's at a bar, and then some guy comes and insult me. Say like no, uh, I really don't care. I just stand up and walk away because I had that problem before. So you will just feel when they walk away. Because I wear sometimes I wear very yeah. sexy dress, right? And one time I sit and wait for my friend come. He will lay a little bit and we plan to meet at that. And because the bar quite high and my skirt quite long sleeve. Yeah, it's like it kind of sexy like, you know, and I wear almost everything a bit sexy. Also, you have nice body. What can you do? <laughs> and then, if you I know that's why you should show it off. Yeah, I know why, you know, everybody have money. They have a different character when they have money. Mm -hmm. And some of these, I don't say all. I'm blessed enough that I meet a lot of guys who got money and very gentlemen. But also some idiot in that environment, <clears throat> they have money and they behave like a very poor behave, right? So he will walk past me. I know what he tried to do. He will try to, he keep looking at me because he want me to look back and then I smile with him or something. But obviously I'm there because You're waiting for I'm waiting for someone. So of course, even I feel that someone look at me, I don't bother. Then he walked past here, he, he looked at me and he didn't he didn't see my reaction. He walked back again one more round and then he walked back again one more round and then he stand next to me <clears throat> where the bartender is doing the drink and he said, Hey bro, how are you? So he tried to make a conversation with the bartender, like he know the bartender. And he just from there he went to Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, whatever like uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And whatever she have can make one more for her. Mm. Of course the bartender would do and pass to me and say it's from another gentleman, right? And I and I, I turn and I like, oh thank you. Uh but you don't have to. My friend is coming. Mm -hmm. I'm very politely because if I go there with attention that I want to have fire a guy or hook up with a guy, I don't mind to have another free drink. But the thing is I'm not come there to try to you have somebody catch else. a guy, right? And then my guy friend comes soon and I don't want him to feel like so awkward. So awkward, like somebody buy a drink for you on the way I'm coming. And I told him uh, I, I, I say, uh, oh, thanks, but uh, my yeah. friend is yeah. coming. You don't have to, but thanks, right? Yeah. So my meaning is, I don't mind to drink what you just buy, but to just let you know that my friend coming. And then he walked past, and then he walked closer to me, and he say, oh, so you already have sugar daddy. And I was, in my, in my heart, I was like, oh, you dare to say that? <laughs> I don't want to have another one. <laughs> And and I were I, I was quiet, I was silent. I don't even smile. I don't take it personal and I don't even smile. I don't even want to talk because for me it's like if that's the, the first thing that you can tell to the girl, it means you're so low class that I should not even have a conversation. Because that's obviously he insult me, right? Well, that means that the only thing he thinks that he has to offer is money. Yes, yes, that, that's why I say some guy. But the way he, he show off is very weird. Like he, he say that and then he hold his drink and he walk around and he say hi to a lot of people in the bar to try to show me like he know a lot of people and all that, right? And for me, it's like, 
yeah, the point. I don't give a shit. <laughs> yeah. I, like, I mean, if you are going around saying hi to all the world leaders, then yeah. you see, yeah, <laughs> like you get, hey, yeah, I yeah, you get number. So, <laughs> then I walk past one more round again, and at this moment he's closer to me already, and he like, so how often you hear? So I pretend like I never hear. I when he asks a question, I straight away take my earphone and I have <laughs> my ear. When he asks a question, I take out my earphone and I start wearing. Uh, you and know, I think it's huge one. Uh. <laughs> no, because you wear a dress, you know, yeah, you want to look yeah, yeah. elegant. You don't want to wear. Bad. If you have the huge one, you have to put it on like. <laughs> and and you can't believe it. He really take my earphone one from me because he really want to talk to me. That's how close he's out he is. He's so rude. I know, right? Don't do that, please. Then, Very rude. No, now it's not rude. Now he come to more bold. Like he talk more bold. I say, you're very difficult, but I love it. You know, like he tried the, the insult to come to the next thing. Like, wow, you're different, girl. You know. Then I, then I, 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 I say, uh, please give back me iPod. I say I can buy for you ten more. What's the problem? I say no problem. I'm just politely ask, can I have back my iPod with yeah. the smile in my face? And at the same time that my my friend come in and he say, can you order for me this drink, oh. whiskey, oh. blah, blah. Then he say, uh, get my name and get the bottle. I have a bottle there. <laughs> then uh, I say, sure, you can have it. This is the second piece. And then I tell the bartender, um, can you take for me the bottle from this? this? I say, this is the phone number. He, he reaching in two minutes. Oh. And at the moment he hear the guy name, the bartender hear the guy name. And he looked at him and like, you date, bro. <laughs> He's <laughs> like, the airport, no. I think, I no. think now, I think I know why he thinks you date, bro, because <laughs> my friend is a very big and tall, <laughs> muscular, muscular guy. He really helps. He really helps. <laughs> and plus, he drinks whiskey, but not a normal whiskey. The like, the freaking expensive, the type. freaking expensive, <laughs> the high end type. The high end is like a few VIP customers. They have that bottle and. And even he hear the name of the bottle, he would drop my earphone and he ran away. And really true enough, you know, when my friend comes, oh, I, like, I can yeah. see, no. I can see that guy from far looking at your friend like shit, shit, shit. I say, oh, I hope she didn't tell no, you. No, you, you should, you should, you should. <laughs> no, I didn't. No, you, you don't tell your friend, but you know what I would have done. No, right? I didn't tell my friend. Oh really? But the funny part, I tell him, just keep looking at him and make mm -hmm. him scared, okay? But don't do anything because I love to make yeah, people know, anxiety <laughs> that corner, but I'll do nothing. When my friend was reading, he was reading, he was like, just tell me one. <laughs> Which finger you want me to break it? <laughs> I, of course, he's not going to do that, but I'm just a joke between the yeah, words. Yeah, yeah. And he, the whole day that when we did ringing and talking, he keep looking there with the eyes of like, I give him a look like I will break your bone kind of feeling. Yeah, you can't the effort. Yeah, yeah.